What's up, peeps? Today, even with this weather, we're going to be checking out Raising Cane. This is my first time checking them out. As far as I know, the only thing they got is chicken fingers. And I would say world famous chicken fingers. So we're gonna check them out. And the expression raising cane means that creating a disturbance. I gotta show you all this weather over here. Look at this. That's the weather we're looking at right there. Like literally, raising cane. All right, so let's go inside, check it out, have some dinner, see what this chicken's hitting for. So this is the raising canes up in Bucks County. Uh, right around the corner from uh, around the corner from Sesame Place. Now I will say that there is a massive line of cars around it, reminiscent of a uh, Chick Fil A, which is kind of funny because there's actually a Chick Fil A right down the street. So, all right, so let's get a little shot of the outside here. There's the famous Post Malone cups, designed by Post Malone, whatever that's worth. Their saying is one love. They have the love of chicken. That is the one love, not like the Bob Marley song. And they're right across from uh, Mission Barbecue. There's actually a Mission Barbecue getting ready to open up where I live, so probably be doing a Mission Barbecue coming up. They got some outside seating right here, nice outside seating. I would probably sit out here. So I imagine that's the, it's actually named after the, the dog's, uh, um, the owner's dog. The dog's name is Kane. So there you go. Uh, how fitting is that? Raising Kane and it looks like the weather is gonna play along with us today, folks. place is packed. It's a Saturday night. This place is packed. My word. School bus just got out. Yes, I know, I'm showing restaurants. They're all unisex restaurants. That's kind of cool. We are raising cane, raising cane right here. Here you go, first try at it. Look at this, we got, uh, we got the combo box. This is like the most popular one. So we got four fingers, four fingers of fun. 
crinkle cut fries. This is the uh, cane sauce, coleslaw, Texas toast. And then you get a drink. I upsized it with the 130 something for the uh, Post Malone cup here. Special collector designed by Post Malone. I don't need, you know, why not, right? But that's it. So it's chicken, fried chicken fingers. And that's all they really do here. That's all they do. There's no desserts, no nothing else. What do you want? You want chicken fingers or chicken fingers? Because you can get chicken fingers, but that's what they have are chicken fingers. All right. So let's check out these chicken fingers and see what they're hitting for. I already know what the fries are going to be hitting for, so I'm not even going to be pressed on the fries. I'll taste the fry. See what the fry. Crinkle crust French fry. All right. It's the cane sauce right there. Oh, that's a fun sauce. Not bad. I like the sauce. Oh, I don't think they have any other sauces. It wasn't like they gave me a choice. All right, so the sauce is good. Now, one of the founders of this place, his story, I was just listening to the story, and it was a very interesting story of how this came to be. I mean, this guy literally worked hard to make this happen. And this is one of the fastest growing chicken places in the world right now. Uh, fast food places in the world. Started like in the 90s. This is the coleslaw. Mmm. Coleslaw? The coleslaw is good. It's nice and crunchy. I can taste everything that's in it. That is really good coleslaw. I like the coleslaw. Uh, so right now, sauce is banging. Coleslaw is banging. Fries are mediocre. I mean, I wouldn't go out of my way for the fries. The coleslaw, I will stop for the coleslaw. All right, now we're going to try the chicken. World famous Raising Cane's chicken right here. Let's try it out. Yeah. Okay. Okay. This is good chicken. It's not dry. It's not over crunchy. Hot fresh chicken for whole day. The, uh, what's the word I want? The outside of it, this, this, I don't would even call it the, the um, crispy outside is nice and crispy. It's a light crispy. It's not a hard crispy, it's a light crispy. It's not a whole lot of spice on it, but it's just enough spice. I really like the chicken fingers for the fact that it, it's, it's moist. It's, it's like, you can tell it's real chicken, right? But I don't know, hopefully you can see that. It does, it's not like liquefied chicken and then, you know, battered and everything. So it's good quality chicken. And it's like they fry it to keep all the moisture in, the white meat. So it's good. So I would say if I came here again, I'd probably just get the fingers. I would just go with a couple fingers, call it a day. Maybe fingers in, a, in the coleslaw. The fries, I can go without the fries. Texas toast, I can go without the Texas toast. I didn't even try it, but I'm not in the Texas toast. I try to cut back where I can. 
So, my rating on Raising Cane's, atmosphere is banging. The chicken fingers, banging. The um, coleslaw, banging. Fries are mediocre. Texas toast, I'm not into it, but I mean, uh, it is what it is. So yeah, if you see them around and you're looking for a good meal, hit them up for them chicken fingers. Definitely a win. All right, peace. So that was Raising Cane's. Have you ever been to a Raising Cane's? Do you plan on going to one? Let me know in the comments or hit me up on the social media. And do you think Raising Cane's is better than Chick-fil-A? I don't know. Thanks for watching this video. Hit that like button. Really do appreciate it. And until next video, remember, take care of each other. Peace out. And I'll see you all soon.